There is so much truth in Bible verses. Truth that you comprehend more as time goes on. There are many layers of belief. And it, many times, is like archaeology to find new and greater truth in a, what is seemingly a simple Bible quote. Here is an example, Psalms 40, verse 8. It says, I delight to do thy will, O my God. When you're doing God's will, it might be totally separate from the way that you wanted to go in the beginning. And, that, and when you do, when you go in that direction, you find daily more delight. There is something that infills you, a well-being, a sense of not only are you following the right path and you know it, but there is just something that happens inside of your soul. And there is no better word for it in the English language than delight. Absolute delight that infills you from the top of your head to the bottom of your feet. Now, let's talk about strong-willed. Someone who is described as strong-willed is usually perceived as the kind of person that insists, absolutely insists on his or her own way. Such personal will is often viewed as something very negative. However, having that same strong will in a different direction can be very positive when it is focused on doing the will of God. When we allow ourselves to only be guided by God, I tell you, we are never disappointed. God's will for us is always for our highest good, and the actions that we will take are always for the highest good of others. And therefore, we can trust divine will to lead us in ways that bring us closer to the perfection of the Christ Spirit. Each time we reach a, a crossroad in our lives that requires action on our part, we ask to be guided in that moment. Instead of just taking the turn in this direction or that, we stop and asked to be guided by divine intelligence. And we're assured that we are making the right choices when we make them. Desiring to do the will of God, we open our lives to continued growth and continued abundant good. I pray today that God's will is your will.